And we did all of those things, and then they come in, and they've, what they've done to this country is incredible. Even staying out for medical reasons, you know all about that. Stay out for medical reasons. I mean, people are very ill, and they're coming into our country. Now they're emptying out, as you know, their prisons, and they're emptying out their mental institutions, which is, you know, they're very smart people. I dealt with the uh, leaders of those countries. I know them all, and they're very streetwise. They're very smart. They, they, uh, they live, and they do well. But they want, why should they pay for mental institutions when we can dump everybody into the United States? Why should they pay for prisons? It's massively expensive. It's a big portion of their budget. Why should they take care of MS-13 gang members, the worst anywhere in the world? Why should they do that? When the stupid people running the United States will do it for them. And what they're doing is poisoning our country. We can't let it happen anymore. Every day... Every day I think of the United States in a way this never happened. This literally, I thought of this yesterday. And I said, you know, I'm coming up to a place that gets it. And maybe I should say it. And I went to my, what do you think? I went to a couple of people that have been with me a long time. It's sort of strange. But I think of the United States every day is April Fool's Day. And they said, sir, what do you mean by that? I don't like the sound of that. And I said, well, listen to this. And I just gave him a couple of ideas. We have open borders when they should be closed. It's April Fool's Day. We have prisoners, people from, as we just said, mental institutions and terrorists being dumped into our country when they should not be accepted. April Fool's Day, right? Who would do that? Who would do this? Who would allow prisoners in? Biden. He goes, Biden. He said, Brandon. <laughs> You're both right. We have no voter ID when everyone wants voter ID, even at the Democrat National Convention. They had a card on the front of them that was like bigger than their chest, with the exception of some people. They had a card. It had everything, pictures, everything. but not for the United States votes, right? So think of it. No voter ID when everyone wants it. Even the Democrats, they did a poll. Eighty-eight percent of Democrats want voter ID. They, ha they don't want because they want to cheat. That's what they're best at. We have a woke military that can't fight or win, as proven in Afghanistan. And we rebuilt the entire military, but we